Well, folks, Bruce here from the Coasters Club, and, you know, there are some problems that you don't realise, that most of us don't realise. I'm in it, I could take a glass. Now, these guys have been 24 hours on their feet now. The lack of electricity supply, when the kilns go out, I'm going to try and find Barry Wilson and, and uh, get an explanation, but, you know, we've at the present time, we've only got power from the amethyst at uh, Harry Harry, and, and it's a real problem. Barry, could you, would you, could you talk to me for a, yes. a minute? Yep. Barry, I know you've been up all night, and uh, like so, I won't, <laughs> so I won't annoy you. Now, now tell, me, um, tell me what the problem is. Well, we, we have a, a, about a three hour window with our furnace. From the 1100, if it gets at 900 degrees, gets below that, the, the glass expands and the furnace cracks, so we lose a furnace. Wow. So if we can't get it, and we usually have a gas burner, you can see over there on the floor, and if we if we can't get that going and thing, then we've lost our furnace. So uh, my understanding from the civil defence briefing last night was that we're on power from amethyst yes. at the moment. Um, now that, that's a that's a real concern. We've got to become uh, energy efficient or, or energy. Um, we've got to we've got to be able to control our own future here, don't we? So we need that's why we need the power scheme either either in the Kakapotai or the Waitā Valley. And what, in 25 years, they tell me 12 canoes have gone down there in the 25 years. Only so, 12? Yes. So, uh, and, and why, I mean, there's other rivers in the west coast that they can canoe in. Yep. So we need our own power and stop relying on the power coming from Christchurch. Well, look, we, it doesn't matter where we go. We've got uh, sewage systems that have stopped. We've got water supply, basic yep. water supplies to communities where we've, we're out, we haven't got any power, so we can't run the darn things. We need a, a community concentration on getting this supporting West Power yep. to get this White Hour project up and running. Can you imagine yesterday if we had heavy rain all day and no power to run our pumps? Yep. Hokitika would have been under about a metre and a half of water. Yeah, we would have. We would have been uh, gone. Yeah, we, yeah. Look, we were so lucky in that shift in the weather. So we have to have our own power scheme. Yeah, well, it, we have to. So Barry, um, this this uh, post will be watched by a lot of people. Yep. We've we've had two days of uh, pretty rough stuff. Is there a message? Yes, own power scheme. We need it, and and whether. All get involved, councils, uh, development west coast, they've got to come on board now and let's get this thing rolling. So yes. self-sufficiency yes. and we need to get them behind West Power to get it done. Yes, yep, West Look, Power and Development West Coast. Well listen, I, I, I won't hold you up and I yep. certainly won't annoy you because I know what you like when you're tired. <laughs> and uh, look, uh, best of yep. luck going forward yep. and uh, I'll catch you later. Yep, thank you.